Hey, hey, hey everyone, it's Nikki V. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make Roblox shirts. Do you find that the tutorial videos are super hard or complicated? Well, not in this one. In today's video, I'm going to make it super quick and easy for you to follow along. So, the first thing you want to do is head over to Google and type in Photopea. You want to look for this logo when you search for it and you want to click the very top one. From here guys, you want to head back over to Google. Now that you're back over on Google, you want to search for Roblox shirt template. Now, as you can see, there are lots of them. This one looks white, but when I click on it, it has the checkered background. This is what you're looking for guys. Make sure whichever one you choose has a checkered background. Then you want to right click with your mouse and then just click copy image. And from here you want to head back over to Photopea. All you want to do from here is click Control V on your keyboard. And then the image that you selected will load up here. Then guys, you want to come back over to Google and you want to search for Roblox shading template. Now, this isn't necessary, but it does give your shirt a better look overall. So you want to make sure that when you click it, it has the checkered background so that it is PNG. Then you just want to right click, copy image and head back over to P and now you're back here you want to hit Control v on your keyboard and as you can see it has pasted the image in but it is the wrong size so you want to if you have the same problem you want to come up here click this little box that says transform controls from here i can now move it around you want to make sure it is the size of your image so just to adjust it you just have to hold down the shift and then you can align it into place like so now you want to add some color to your shirt right so you want to click this little box here it's rectangle and then you want to select the whole of the image Ah. but you're thinking it's all red I can't see anything so now what you want to do is you want to drag this underneath so that the background is on top and same again underneath there you go see the detail I take the shader off it just looks boring turn it on and it just gives it more detail Guys, if you are enjoying this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more Roblox tutorials, hit that subscribe button where we have got plenty. Right, so from here, guys, you want to come up to the fill box. Oops. And this is where you can change the color. Now, I want to go for gray. So... If that's not the um, shade that I'm wanting, I just click on this box right here and I can adjust the shade like so. But I'm pretty happy with the grey that it is. And then you just click over on the right hand side and you want to click Raticize. Easy as that. So now we have our plain t-shirt, yours will be the colour of your choice and from here we're now going to make the neck area. So what you want to do is make sure you're still on shape 1. You want to come over to this box here. It will probably be a rectangle for you but you want to make sure you click the ellipse and then you want to head over to your shirt template 
and then you want to make a circle not too big because it's only the neck area I'd say about there and then you just want to move it to the center you will see a red line appear when you are in the center of the shirt and then from here you just want to click Control X on the keyboard and you want to do the same on each layer on the right hand side so Control X and once again at the top Control X now you have your shirt with the neck let's now choose an image now you're back over on Google you want to search some sort of design that you want for your t-shirt I'm going for cute so instantly I am drawn to the mushrooms and the Nutella but I think I'm gonna go with the Nutella for my t-shirt so I click on the Nutella right click copy image and then we head back to photo P now you're back over on photo P you want to hit Control V on your keyboard as you can see that is a huge image so I'm gonna come up to the top and I'm gonna click on the transform controls and here is where I can now make it smaller don't forget guys your images do not want to be too big because Roblox won't accept them I'm kind of happy with that if you want to zoom in on your image come down to the magnifying glass just down here above the two color boxes and then click on the plus sign and scroll in clicking on the image if you want to come back out just click the minus and it'll go back to how it was but always remember to come back up here and click the mouse cursor so I'm pretty happy with that I like that so I may just adjust it once more I need to bring it down remember guys all your layers need to be under the background so the background layer has to always be the top I may just shrink it a little bit more pull it about there it's not too close to the neck and as you can see that looks pretty good now we want to take the arms off so for this you want to click this little rectangle box again make sure you select the rectangle and then you want to come over to the bottom part of the t-shirt now it's up to you how long you want your sleeves to be so it personal preference I'm gonna go about here I'm gonna pull all the way across and then we're gonna hit Control X and then you can just click on the image and now I have my short sleeves and then you just want to click off the rectangle and now that is your shirt complete so to save it guys you want to click file export make sure you export it as a PNG save it whatever you want to call it I'm gonna call mine the Nutella tea Nutella tea I better put grey in case I make other colours and save it and from here you can then head over to Roblox once you're over on Roblox you want to go to create now I have a boutique so I want to make sure it goes into my uh, boutique that I have just made so now I will go down to shirts as you can see I already have some and then you want to choose file my box has now popped up yours will choose you want to choose where you save your 
Roblox shirt to. So I will then select it. As you can see, it now says Nutella Grey Tea. Upload for 10 Robo Robux. <laughs> Would you like to upload? Confirm. Shirt successfully and this is where you click the cog icon if you want to sell your shirt, which obviously you do. You click sales, item for sale and then select the amount you want. I always choose 10. Save, make sure you click that save guys or else it won't save. And then I will go over to my groups. This is my community guys, but I have just opened Nikki V Boutique. So if you want to check out any of my designs, you're more than welcome to. Link will be down in the description and then I can come to store and it is now being up. Loaded. It can take a few minutes guys so do be patient and that guys is how you make a Roblox shirt super quick easy and simple I really hope you enjoyed today's video if you did smash that like button hit that subscribe button for future video uploads on Roblox tutorials and gameplay and also come and check out the live streams live every Monday Wednesday Friday 4pm UK time come and get involved in the Roblox games and meet the community over there if you want any more tutorials comment below let me know and I will make a video on it thank you for watching guys until the next video bye